I told you that right now you have dozens of tiny mites eating, laying eggs, dying, and leaking feces all over your face? Turns out, you probably do. I'm Anna Rothschild, and this is Gross Science. <laughs> Face mites, or demodex mites, are wormy-looking creatures with eight tiny legs. They're arachnids, related to spiders, scorpions, and ticks, and they're really common. They're found in pretty much every society on the planet, and most healthy adults have at least a few. People usually acquire their first mites during childhood, but they don't really start getting busy till you hit puberty. And that's because face mites love oily skin. They live in the hair follicles on your forehead, cheek, and nose, or, depending on the species, inside the sebaceous or oil-producing glands surrounding those follicles. They eat sebum, or skin oil, and also slurp out the insides of your dead skin cells. And that's where things get really gross. You see, face mites don't have anuses. Bummer. They store all of their poop in their abdomens until the day they die, at which point they decompose and leak feces all over your face. In fact, some scientists think that the bacteria in their poop could be related to certain skin conditions, like rosacea or blepharitis. Each mite only lives for about two and a half weeks, but that's more than enough time for them to crawl out onto your skin at night to mate around the edges of your hair follicles. The female then burrows back down and lays one gigantic egg. Two and a half days later, you've got a brand new baby mite, ready to once again begin the circle of life on your face. Ew. Got a question about face mites? Let me know in the comments. And for more gross science, hit subscribe.